His Majesty walked out in Sandringham with his wife, Queen Camilla. On Sunday, King Charles went to church in Sandringham for the first time since his cancer diagnosis was announced. He was sighted heading to St. Mary Magdalene Church on Sunday morning with his wife, Queen Camilla. His Majesty, 75, looked dapper for the occasion. Dressed in a thick wool coat, charcoal gray pants, and suede chestnut colored shoes. Camilla, 76, looked immaculate as always, clad in a spotless cream coat and a stunning fur trimmed hat. Charles was spotted waving to royal fans gathering at Sandringham to catch a peek of the king. The king looked to be in excellent spirits as he met the Reverend Canon Dr. Paul Williams, who then joined the pair as they headed to church. Charles's church visit follows the announcement of his cancer diagnosis on Monday. According to a Buckingham Palace statement, it read, During the king's recent medical operation for benign prostate enlargement, a separate source of worry was identified. Subsequent diagnostic testing revealed a kind of cancer. His Majesty has begun a program of regular treatments during which he has been advised by doctors to postpone public appearances. During this time, His Majesty will continue to do state business and official paperwork as normal. The King has chosen to stay at Sandringham while undergoing treatment, most likely because the Royal Palace allows His Majesty greater solitude. A source told Hello that when the King visits Sandringham, he might find consolation. One of the tour guides remarked that he likes eating breakfast and afternoon tea in front of his gorgeous gardens. Even when the mansion is open and he is staying, the king prefers to live upstairs. While Charles has postponed any public appearances, he was seen for the first time since his cancer diagnosis on Tuesday as he exited Clarence House. While there, he met with his son, Prince Harry who had flown over from the United States after learning of his father's cancer diagnosis. It is believed that the father-son combo spent about 45 minutes together before the monarch was transported to Buckingham Palace with Camilla. On Saturday, Charles delivered an emotional message thanking the people for its support. I would like to express my most heartfelt thanks for the many messages of support and good wishes. I have received in recent days, he said in a statement. As all those who have been affected by cancer will know, such kind thoughts are the greatest comfort and encouragement. He finished by adding, It is equally heartening to hear how sharing my own diagnosis has helped promote public understanding and shine a light on the work of all those organizations which support cancer. Patients and their families across the UK and wider world. My eternal love for their relentless care and commitment is all that 